Right, so how sharp is this chain? How are we going to tell? Well, I think let's just sort of move the camera in and we'll do some action. So I can see some light being reflected off this edge here, edge of the cutter. Now, I'm using not using gloves because I'm demonstrating, but normally, of course, you would wear gloves when you're sharpening. This is a 325 um, pitch chain and it's got a semi chisel cutter on it and I'm using a 4.8 mil file with the correct traditional guide. Hopefully all that makes sense. If not, I've got a video all about selecting file size which I will put a link to as an end screen of this video. So we've got the right angle and I'm getting rid of the damage. How do you know it's sharp? Well the best way is to run your thumbnail or some other implement forwards and if you feel a burr can you see that my colour, the colour of my thumbnail is changing? If you feel a burr all the way along then it's sharp because the file has broken through the surface and has created a burr standing upwards. Mm -hmm. If you don't get the burr it's not sharp however much you file it. So we'll just move to the next cutter which is here and I can see some reflection on the end or in fact all the way along so it's 30 degrees angle the this part of the the guide filing guide sits on the depth gauge don't do that it's got to be down like that right and then not on that end but on that end so we want a little bit more There we go, that's good. And of course, all the cutters should be the same size. Otherwise, you'll get vibration and uneven cutting and not cutting in a straight line. And of course, we have an aeroplane in the background. Isn't that a huge surprise? So moving on, as you can see, the next cutter has got damage as well. I know this is blunt because there was some flint in the timber. So I'm going to continue on, but this is an ever such a short video on how to check whether your chain is sharp. And of course, the cutter can be as sharp as a sharp thing, but if your depth gauge is either too high, in which case it won't cut, this is the depth gauge here, or if it's too low, then um, it, your chain will kick like a mad thing. So we put the guide on here, and we just check and actually it just needs a bit more there we go hopefully you found that interesting catch up with you soon